Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. A massive event just rocked the AI community. DeepSeek has gone viral worldwide, thanks to its free and open source nature and output quality rivaling OpenAI's O1 model. It has gained a huge following. Just take a look at GitHub. Its starred count has skyrocketed to over 60,000, up from 16,000 the last time we checked. That's insane. However, we've noticed that DeepSeek's online version sometimes experiences server overload, making it hard to access. So today we're bringing you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to run DeepSeek R1 locally and offline. Let's dive right in. Step one, install Alama. First, we need to install a runtime environment that allows local execution. We recommend Olama, which supports running all versions of the DeepSeek R1 model for free. Head over to the official website, click the download button, and select the version compatible with your computer. For this example, we'll use a Windows PC. The file size is around 700 megabytes. Once downloaded, double click to install. After installation, you'll see it in your system tray. That means you're good to go. Step two, copy the DeepSeek R1 model code. Now let's get the DeepSeek R1 model. Go back to Olama's official website and click the Models tab at the top left. The first option you see should be DeepSeek R1. That's right, it's already integrated. Click on the model and you'll find different versions based on your computer's VRAM capacity. If you're unsure which one to choose, here's a general recommendation. Lower VRAM, pick a smaller model. Slow inference speed, downgrade to a lower version. For this tutorial, we'll use the 7B version, which is the most commonly used. Click the copy button next to it. This will copy the command we need to download the model automatically. Step three, open Windows PowerShell. Now, let's install the model. Find Windows PowerShell in your system search bar and open it. Alternatively, press Win plus R, type CMD, and hit enter to open the command prompt. This interface might look intimidating, but don't worry, we'll guide you through it. Paste the command you copied earlier and hit enter. Alama will now automatically download and install DeepSeek R1 for you. Once the installation is complete, you can start asking questions directly. Try typing a question and pressing enter. You should see think appear, meaning DeepSeek R1 is processing your query. And the best part, it works even when you're offline. However, we understand that this command line interface may not be user friendly for beginners. So if you prefer a clean and intuitive UI, something like ChatGPT, let's move on to the next step. Step four, using the Page Assist extension. To enhance your experience, let's set up a browser-based interface. Open the Chrome Web Store and search for Page Assist. The first result is the one you want. Click Add to Chrome. Once installed, find the Page Assist icon in the top left corner. Open it, and you'll see it's already linked to the model and Olama we just set up. Select the model you installed earlier. Before using it, we need to tweak some basic settings. Click the settings icon in the top right corner, enable RAG settings, and select your model under Embedding Model. Save your changes, and you're ready to go. Now try asking a sample question. What day comes after the day before yesterday? Boom! The answer appears instantly. Additionally, you can also enable the internet search feature in the bottom left corner to ask about the latest news. Pretty straightforward, right? You can even switch between other models if you have them installed. And that's it! This is how you can run DeepSeek R1 locally and offline using Alama and the Page Assist extension. If you have any questions, drop a comment below. We'd love to help. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you don't miss our future tutorials. See you in the next video.